Putin's Boy, Steven Seagal vs. Zombie Vampires in Against the Dark from 2009. Directed by, and I swear I ain't making this up, Richard Crudo. The survivors of a mass fire infection scavenge a hospital for supplies without knowing they've stumbled upon a hive of the undead. Seagal and his band of mercenary vigilantes, who I really wish were more in this film, race against the clock to save the uninfected before a tactical nuke wipes out the entire city. Seagal mumbles his lines and swings his sword as usual and brings the action to an otherwise mediocre 28 weeks later ripoff. The primary cast of survivors are decent, but that's just it. The real stars are, surprise surprise, Seagal's merc crew who bring the pain to the bloodsuckers. The moments with them are enjoyably trashy, somewhat aided possibly by the tepid moments with the lukewarm survivors. The primary cast just don't have any chemistry, and the stupefying choices made by their characters further alienate them from the audience. Their bickering just kills the film's pace dead. So, in conclusion, Against the Dark is one part boring zombie horror, and one part satisfyingly kitsch Seagal vehicle. Just yet another tale of two films that seem to be a recurring theme in this series. If you can get past the dull and dumb survivor characters, then you can get the scene where Seagal shish kebabs a vampire kid. Sounds like a fair deal? If so, this film is for you. Thank you for listening. Please remember to like, comment and subscribe. Tomorrow's film is from 1999 again. Brian Usener's Progeny.